Hey coach, welcome back to the channel. If you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to stay up to date with all the latest content. And if you want to get in contact with me to book a free one-on-one -on -one call, there's the best way to do it is if you visit the description below this video, there will be a link. If you click on the link, you can book a 25 minute call with me where we can jump on Zoom. You can ask me questions with regards to your business and I can show you some action steps to take this week to grow and scale your business to the next level. So if you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to stay up to date with all the content that I put out on a weekly basis. So today's video is the top objections. So the top parent objections faced by private soccer trainers in this industry. So if you've been following our channel for a while, then you will know that I put a lot of content out on, on YouTube. A lot of content is content that I have created from experiences of working with a lot of private trainers in this industry. So as most of you probably know, if you've been following me for a long time, I speak with a lot of coaches every single day. I also work with coaches on a regular basis. And what I decided to do today is, is to do a very short presentation on the top parent obje objections that uh, most private trainers face in this industry when they work with customers, customers, clients. Okay. So if you have a look at the screen in front, then obviously you will see that this is going to be today's presentation. Okay. And what I want to do now is scroll onto the next page. Okay. So if we have a look at the first objection, Okay, so we'll move on to the next, the, the first objection with it, which is usually from parents, uh, your program costs too much. Okay, so since I've been working with coaches, probably the number one objection that I get from a lot of coaches who, when I ask them, what's, what's the biggest objections or why are customers not joining your program? The, the number one objection is your program costs too much, okay? So the customer has either reached out via social media, they probably booked a call or they've applied to your program through your website. And what you've done is you've probably sent them information with regards to how much your, your program costs per hour. So a big, big mistake a lot of coaches do is they base their cost of training on what they charge per hour. So for example, if a, a parent reaches out to you and you respond via text message with the cost of our program is $100 per hour, right? Now, you've got to remember most parents, even though they've landed on your website or they've come across your, your, your Instagram page, your Facebook page, they've got in contact with you some way. Most of them don't know what you do. Most of them don't know what your company or your program is about. So the first thing they're going to do is they're going to check to see how much you're charging and they're going to base price off of value. Okay. Because if you've said, if you've replied to them saying the cost of the program is a hundred dollars per hour, that means that all your program is, is it's a per hour program and nothing more. Okay. So when, when parents join and they see that you're charging $100 per hour for a one-on-one -on -one or a small group session, right? They are comparing value on what you're charging, okay? So they, they don't know that you do this, you do this, you do this away from the session. All they, all they think of is, right, this coach runs a one-hour training session and he charges $100 for that one-hour training session, and that's it. 
And that is ultimately the number one objection that you're going to face with your business. Okay, so what we want to do is we want to move away from marketing. And when we talk to parents, we want to move away from solely selling on per hour. Okay, and we want to sell a three month, six month or 12 month program. Because if you sell a program, then that means there's more value than just a one off a one hour training session. Okay, so if we move on to the second objection, second objection is don't have time, can't come every week. Okay, really common objection a lot of coaches have with customers that reach out um, or that come for a, for a session and then they, they can't continue for whatever reason. Okay, so if we look at the next slide, right, solution number one. So this is the solution to our first objection. Okay, so if your objection is that your program is very expensive, so your one-on-one -on -one program is very expensive, then the solution is have multiple offers from expensive to affordable, okay? So when I work with, with private soccer coaches, we essentially work together and I help them build a expensive program, which is a premium high-end type of program, which is usually one-on-one -on -one training. And then from there, we work down to a more affordable clinic, which is less of a commitment and it's probably just once a month for the parent, okay? So more expensive means more of a commitment. Cheaper means less of a commitment. So for you, it's important to have multiple offers that you can then offer to parents. So having, if if your objection that you're getting is it, your program costs too much or your training session costs too much, then you can respond by saying, hey, Mrs. Jones, I understand that our program, our one-to-one -one program costs too much and it might be outside of your price range. However, we do have alternative options which might be more affordable for you. And that's where you can offer your small group training sessions where it might be anywhere between four to six players. You can sell them on a camp, which is going to be a lot more affordable because there's more players and it's more of a le less personal attention for the for the child or a clinic which might be a monthly clinic that you run so having multiple offers from expensive really expensive really high end premium to more affordable such as a monthly kin clinic or a monthly camp okay so if we have a look at the next slide the next one is solution 2 which was the first objection that we don't have time and we can't commit every week. So again, solution two is offer them into a program which is less of a commitment. So if you're selling a one-on-one -on -one training program or a package which is three, six or 12 months and the parent turns around and says, right, we can't commit for that long, then you want to be able to offer them something which is of a less of a commitment. So it might be a monthly camp, it might be a monthly clinic, it might be a quarterly camp, right? So it might be some type of program that you run either once a month, once every two months, or on a quarterly basis, where it doesn't require them to come and show up every single week, like a one-on-one -on -one training program, okay? So having multiple offers and having multiple uh, programs which are high commitment, which is your one-on-one -on -one training, to less of a commitment, which is your more affordable option, which could be a monthly clinic, okay? So if you are a coach and, this, and these objections are something that you're struggling with, you don't know how to overcome them, you want more help, okay? Number of ways you can reach out to me, but the best way will be either via my email, which is makemoneycoachingsports at gmail.com. Okay, connect with me through there, or you can book a call with me. Again, visit the description below. There's going to be my Calendly link where you can book a free 25-minute call where we jump on Zoom 
I can ask you some questions, see where you're at, see where you want to get to. And I can show you some action steps to take this week to overcome these objections and help your business to grow and scale to the next level. Okay, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.